No, I mean, I got no. Mm-hmm. May I go see if I'm here a photo? Tell me, collection. Hey. I'm not hearing a feedback now. Let me try it out. Yeah, it's still there. Not me, not you. Can't be me. You have something when I was coming live in the background that was making a sound. But I'm not hearing myself now, so I don't know. That means they are you. That's what I'm saying. My life. You owe me a closer this morning. I'm turning everything off in my background. Everything is off. Yo, I wonder if the ancestors they make me look so. They have clue right now. Because if yeah. you have fun in our background, anything you have in our background at all. No, but that cannot cast the double sound in. That, that's not caused by fun. I don't something. Tell me. I mean, you I turn off everything. I viral king, you know. Who are you with now, don't? Everything off. You turn off your earphone? You turn off everything in the background. The headphone? Yeah, yes, plug them. See that? You know. Turn them off. You can't turn off. But on the ear, stop panic. But you, but you know, realize that when you take out the headphone out of your ears, right? Mm -hmm. The ending of your speech is uh, chopping off. See, when you have it in it, not chop off the end of the speech, is then, but it's a gear that, that, that double up. So here you are. Make it stay. Make sure I understand what you say, even though the last part of every one of your speech, I got chop off. Gotcha. I hear it from my cousin. But go ahead. So, yeah, that tell you about the, Two and a half business way. You have one atomic collection. And the next two and a half hour now. I'm stressed out. All right, so. Go on. We are We are worried about talk. It's just the food. All right, so. Yes, um, yes one is atomic collection. But I want to. This is annoying. You hear it a chip, right? You hear the last part of your conversation a chip. Well, listen now. So you put in the headphones, it don't chip. But it uh, you need to disconnect the headphone off of your phone completely. That's what I said. You lock it in the case, but you need to plug off your earbuds. Like, but they're on the, well, they're the, I do live every You hear? Yeah, you know, there. No, I mean, I thought about when you go up on your settings, like your earpods, earpods will connect to your Bluetooth. Which part you go and click the connect earpod, disconnect earpod off of your phone. Not just close the case, disconnect it off of your phone. Because obviously, it has a problem. You yeah. turn off your Bluetooth. You turn no. your, yeah, you turn off your Bluetooth now? Yeah. May I hear you now? Bluetooth off. I'm still right. like... And you still are cut. Then how are they for? <laughs> I don't know. Tell me, tell me them over here to them, man. Them science are right, too. No, for real. Because I come live every day. Well, I don't know. I'm sure I know my friend. But continue now. I could see how far we can reach. These are serious. Continue. I'm going to kick out that. We do that 10 million times, Tommy. Yeah. How that work? I don't know. You have to just talk and we'll see if it works. Take off this. We never want to speak of it. Yo, Vega, say restart your phone. Uh, <laughs> All right, Tommy, restart your phone and come back. Make a day. Yeah, people. Um, Well, you know, only know, so I'm not really. Today, now, Sunday, I'm not
no negativity in our energy right now. So when time you talk about entrepreneurial skill and evolving from being a regular person to um a a, a business person, because of course you know Tommy you now big in the merchandise world and she has sell all the product and she has to end up have warehouse now and things so her business evolved from selling two little slippers and two little blows to she has sell thousands of items and a ship worldwide yeah um big up sis like and big up the rest of them you know you don't know the thing as i said before if sis lawa will have a dialogue as two educated civilized persons you can always join me live and i listen to nice you know she will probably command them with a dm and a text text and a come with arrogance if a man in sizzler now have a grand figure them have five bills you know him now see them you know them not loyal you know at the end of the day no matter who me have run me a foot of hype of the brand you see me and no matter who sizzler have run him him at the brand so I mean, I listen outside influences you understand yeah so as I may have said, I have to tag Sizzler. Sizzler say everything when I say and hear everything when I say. And the artist thing all over social media. So if him not see it himself on film page, somebody I gotta show him. Brad Bakar, one of them I gotta show him. I Bubba Collins and say, see what the boy I say. So I say, I never like him demeanor, I never like him approach, I never like him tone of voice, I never like what I say. So that's why me end up forward. I say with me that say not the way me I say it. Because when me I defend righteousness, me not really beg for any understanding me I say. I see like them see him and teach you that and keep it and them and the whole of them, you understand me I say. So when you can't expect me now to use what me learn from Uno when me I defend righteousness, even though the fire they pan Uno. Uno if you just admit it, say your foot attack truth and foot are passionate but way I say. And he might speak in mind and he not care. You see me? So if you don't want to educate me, so if you don't feel like me, I go about it the wrong way. You understand? I don't have to forward my life. I mean, in a private discussion neither. Because the people need it now more than ever. So any discussion me are all with Sizzler, or Capitan, or Butchu, or Anthony B, or any Rasta in defense of righteousness and the people, them, them have to come do it publicly. You understand me? I say publicly upon that social media something. You hear that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Yeah, secret reasoning, you see me? Mm -hmm. I think it's still, it's still gonna squeak with us, so I have to go do this one all right here. You're putting back your ears piece now? No. Talk. <laughs> No, it's still gonna speak. I don't know what's happening. So uh, it now squeak, you know, but the end of your speech they might chop off. So I mean, I understand that. I don't know what happened. Oh. So if you're going and you're living in Taiwan different, somewhere no, understand. it's not me. I'm not chipping. You no, not me. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to see this year. I don't know what's happening. Talk now, tell me. Yes, I mean, I said when both of us are You see, when you come out and you perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. But tell me, you are free. is what oh, I normally talk about. People are calling the phone. People are calling the phone, tell me. So it's a circle and a load every minute. Because I chip up and come back in. So let me just. All right, but... See if we can make this work because we don't know what happened. Because they might tell me, see, I'm not going to have nothing. To right? And if if I want to put the filter on, that's just my thing. All right, let's do this footer. Okay, they're really strong.
They have a week like a rat. <laughs> very strong woman. All right, trust me, Solomon shall live the universe of the strongest force on earth. Yeah, so as me, I said, Tommy. Your mic when she speaks, there would have been a deep breath. I'll have to tell him that now, man. No mic for what? So, hear me, I said, Tommy. Explain to me about the other two and a half businesses. I don't know why you talk about the two and a half businesses. Don't worry about it. But here we're going to do is say it at one here, here, right? So, um, I am the owner of Tammy's collection. Tammy's collection is a separate entity from Tammy, uh, Tom Cole's shoe. So, Tom Cole's shoe is the entity that sells all That is different from Tammy's collection. is collection and Tom Cole's shoe sells all in Japan. Um, businesses in Jamaica. So that's who. Um, Tommy is that is where I train people to make consistent revenue using social media platforms. That is like an academy for entrepreneurs. And the thing that I'm a part owner in is that Airbnb in Ultraris, we're just off the ground to Airbnb Turtle Tower that open next month. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, that's a serious business because tourists always I go watch your race, no matter where in the world them come from. Mm -hmm. So that's a good business, you understand me, I say? Mm -hmm. um, so Tommy, explain to me what started you when you have the seventy five dollar loan. Why anybody think you go buy some burger? And eat or <laughs> go get food or all the seventy five dollars they work out. I'm more, trying more. to change my position. I'm trying to change where I'm sitting or I don't know. I like that change position something. <laughs> Let me see if we can come sit down with your stuff and get some help. I wish you got that I was mute, Mike. Then if I mute my mic, come and do my have a conversation. No, if you mute the mic, that means that me not going to hear your background. But you can't hear me. But me not going to talk to you either. If I mute my mic. Oh, she's just saying that. You mute the mic, that's it for me. The feedback from you to see if it's the feedback from your background. I'm going to tell you something wrong with my side girl more. See you soon. Better waters. Ah, uh, mute, mute. So, mute them. Just mute. Then it's on better. Me no know if you mute one ear. Mute or you do that. It's the you see the camera microphone. I see the microphone. It's just the camera. And then something else. Like the microphone. No. No, so me only have questions and camera. Me no have a microphone to mute. Anyway, yeah, yes, and all, yes. I don't know people, I go on live every single day, and this does not happen. So, I, yeah, it's muted. So, you see, I know that I go on live every day, but whenever you're on someone else's live, and they are, um, no matter what, in the back. The ear condition and it's making a sound, it's going to interrupt the audio. Remember, I said, put on a with people, you know. I go live with people all the time. Yeah. So, even for the. They are over here, man. Where come from again? Moby are sent to this, but they are science. They are fleeing from science. Let's do this. You have to go mute your mic. Yeah, sir. When you ask the question, you just mute and just just work with you for me. Uh, yeah, explain to me all the seventy five dollars turned seven million now. Oh, it's just because of my mindset. That is what set me apart from other people. My mindset. A lot of people, when they have money, they think about all the things that they want to do that is not going to be beneficial to them or their families. I, when I had the money, I said to myself, I don't want to be a kept citizen who have the system decide how much money I'm supposed to make at the end of each month, the end of the week. 
I was determined. I had something in me that I know that everything that people say, everything that someone say about me that I cannot um, be that person. I told myself that no person, place or things is going to stop me. So I am going to do this regardless. And I remember someone telling me that when you come to foreign, that's what they say. You come a foreign, you have to decide which slice of the cake you want for yourself. So at that point in time, I said to myself, I want the slice that I decided to take and not the slice that people going to say half is yours or a quarter is yours. So I said, you know what? I am going to work assiduously for everything that I need. But I just get up one day and say, I'm tired of this, you know. I don't want to be the person here where I have a man give me things or go, um, sleep with men to get what I want, even though I don't have to. So what I did was, me looking at my bank account and she said it was on almost negative. And I said, I can't live from paycheck to paycheck because I remember that I have to make a commitment to my commitment that I want to help my family. I might not be the rich. I wasn't, I, I wouldn't be the rich first, rich person in my family because there are other people that my, my brothers that have money more than I, but I'm not going to decide on them. So I work hungry days i go through it and i tell people this every day i don't look like what i've been through i remember days put our making a foreign and hungry and people look at me and say how oh, you they're foreign and broke and hungry right my hungry hungry kill me gas take me up i have to come out of my bed in the night and go a wall green so we actually i talked to a dead person yes a hungry kill you <laughs> 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 Fact though, but I don't look like what I've been through, people. And I ask God, why me? Why I have to go through everything that I've, I I am going through? Why do I have to go through this? And I took I was depressed. I was in a depressive mood. And I want every day that I wake up, I go back to bed. And when I'm going to sleep wasn't going there naturally i'm taking benadryl to sleep i start taking nyquil to sleep because every time i feel like whenever i'm sleeping i feel better about myself because i don't have to think about the things that i'm going through rent is going to come up i'm in a one i feel i got through all of them something here so me I, I was just like just sick and tired of being sick and tired and i said to a lot of people that hey I do, that's why I start my mentorship program because I want people to know that no matter what you're going through, just believe in yourself. Think, work on your mind. Because a lot of us taking, um, focusing on the money, but we're not thinking to get our mind right. We're not thinking to get, um, believe in ourselves, especially ladies. They don't believe in, we don't, they don't teach us to, to believe in ourselves, but this is something that we got to learn. I know that I have to learn to love Tommy because I never loved Tommy. And I love Tommy. I start work on my mind. And once I start working on my mind, I realize that the money comes easy. The money comes easy. And people, I want you to know, once you learn how to pay $2, you can pay $2. Because it's... Um, hey, more I know, Tommy. Um, the $75. A dapper than me one year. But... What was the first thing you do with the seventy five dollar we turn into other money? What what was that move? I can say a little about that, but I cannot say a lot about that. My publicist actually warned me before I came on this live. Tommy, the book is coming. You have the book on your website and it's pre ordered for nineteen dollars. You can go up there and make foot at twist you and turn you and you give out all the information because it is in the book right so but what i can say though is what i always share with people when i look in my bank account and saw the 75 dollars i can call the person name right this minute that i went on our page it's Cheryl, the dancer queen girl she was selling lipstick i remember she was selling lipstick in the foot and when i yeah, saw Yes, I saw the lipstick. I'm going to say, you know, me can't do that. And it's first, I'm actually going to call her name. 
And I, I, when I saw her selling the lipstick, I said to myself, you know, I can't, I, I can't do that. And I went on um, eBay and I saw the lipsticks. And I only could have afforded 12 with the money plus shipping. The next week is going to be rent. Remember, me there for, and I, I said, you know what, I'm not going back at the job because them people are always telling me, say, me are the black girl and me this and me that because I face racism so many times, right? In America, especially when you're working for Caucasian. Them people are treated like you're nothing. So I said, I'm not going back. This $75, I'll go buy some lipstick. I purchased 12 and Next week is the rent. At that time, my rent was like five fifty, And I said to myself, Tommy, you now go back, but you are going to sell them lipstick here. When I purchased the lipsticks, you know what I did? I text everyone in my phone. I text everybody in my phone, and I said to myself, if they're not buying me, I cut them off. Because this is the journey that I'm willing to take. And if people can't support it, I'm willing to lose you. So that is when I, I if, you, if I take some man and him say, you know, you know, want a lipstick, I say, you know, I have no mother, you know, I have no female family member, you know, like I was willing to sell because I have the hustle in me. I'm just, if, if some of them answer me some type of way, I just block them. Because when you're ready to elevate, not everybody's going to understand your journey. But you have to be willing to lose people to get to where you want to because sometimes it's the people around us, they're the one that is pulling us back. So me, yeah, me lose a whole heap of people in my greatness. So me, me glad. You see me, some of them hurt, it hurt. Because some of them you really want to hang on to as friends or, uh, you know, family. And then you think about them the same way. And you still reminisce upon the times. But in my brain, me know say it cannot work. Me have it done with you. As yeah. much as I want to deal with you still, it's better for me done with you in order for me to swear to new heights like Air Jamaica. Yeah. You know? Mm -hmm. So, okay. So this book is available. I don't want really go in too much for real, you know, because you have to make, it's, it, you have it in an audio book too? We are trying to work on the book, but for now it's going to be the book that you can download. Okay, all right, because audiobook is good. Because you all me now, um, I can't read, I can't write, but I rather listen, I rather just play something and listen. You know what I'm saying? Yes. So, I, I might think that me, me, me can't read, but I don't like reading. You understand what I'm saying? So, and everything you can do, you really like it. You see me? You rather listen like me, I listen to CDR, you know? Because even some long video, more time followers them send me. But just press play and I listen and now watch the video. Yeah. Come here, retain what I hear. You know what I'm saying? So, we need to try it. You have any hard copy of the book? The hard copy comes after the ebook. All right, so, you my editor, me tell the people them where you can. Oh, your Vegas to ask who is your publisher? She don't want to be named. She anonymous okay all right so you need to tell the people them um, which part them can go go get this book here and get them them hustling start all right so my book is available my book is available on my website and you can follow my page it's tammy's collection or Tommy's under, Tommy underscore collection and my website is www.tammyscollections.com and also the book when you go in the drop down men, um, bar you will see ebook you can press that and it will take you directly to the book what I can tell you is that the book is going to show you how to navigate social media we're going to give you a little gems of how you use social me media to make money. I can tell you this. I'm talking to Futa Hype right now. And when I get off, I'm going to get $250 from Instagram. I post a video 24 hours ago on Reel. And I already make $180 something. 
every time I use my Instagram to do something that I love, I make money from it. If I post a video in my IGTV, um, yes, Vegas. <laughs> they want me to answer all these questions. All right. So if, if I upload something to my IGTV, I, I make money too, just like you make money on YouTube, right? So in their social media is there for us to make money. They are paying me to do something that I already would have done for my business. I make, I, my money is making on autopilot and it is there for me. So in my book, we're going to teach you how to navigate the tools on social media to make money. I'm going to teach you marketing tips. I'm going to show you how did I get there? Like it is so much in the book that I myself, when I read it, I feel like it's a Bible. Every entrepreneur, if you're planning to start a business or you have a business, this is for you. This is why I start my Tammy's Let's Build Academy. When I started my journey, there's a lot of business people that I reach out to to ask them, hey, where you get vendors? Where you get this? How you do that? How you do that? People so selfish, they don't willing to share information with people to put them on to the money. I can drop the blueprint in your lap, but it is your work ethics and your mindset is going to get you closer to it than I or, oh, did I get there? A lot of us, we have to pay people to discipline us in things that we should have disciplined ourselves into. But what you have to do as a person, if you know that everybody need mentor. I have mentor. I need another one right now. So if you feel like you're not disciplined enough and you can pay somebody to teach you what you're supposed to know so that you can make consistent revenue, starting a business is one, right? You can start a business and say that you, you, you borrow some money, but you feel like you're failing because you see all these merchandise sitting in front of you and they're not selling. I never thought I was, I thought I was failing, but at that time, I never, I, I was just not succeeding. I was just not making money. And people, listen, when you wake up one morning and you see your website go up and you have a $2,000 in your Shopify app and it's not even 10 o'clock yet, your money's working for you. What about passive income? The money is working for you on autopilot because if you have a business, you have to know what's your revenue, what's this, what's that, and that's all you have to do. People, I am on social media. I am not trolling people. I am not putting out negativity in the atmosphere. I, every time you see me show up on Instagram, I'm paid. I'm being paid to be there. And you, a lot of people might look at it and say, oh, Tommy is bragging. No. You set yourself in a position to market yourself. You set yourself in a position to brand yourself. Here I am sharing marketing tips and giving you some gems. And there was just somebody in the comment section. I don't address comment, but I'm just saying this to say that. You know my face. You said every live you go on, you see me. Guess why? Because I am the owner of Tammy's collection. I brand myself. I'm marketing myself. So you will see me everywhere because you're not going to see me with drama. You're going to see me talking about how to set my mind right and get my money right. I refuse to be less fortunate. I refuse to have to have the system decide for me. I decide to do it for me. And there are nights when I stayed up all night and I'm tired. But I have to remind myself that the yikes by great men reached and kept were not attained by sudden flight. But they, while their companions slept, were upward toiling through the night. So when you see me on the live, it's just the start because you're going to see the billboard and you're going to see Tammy's collection out there because we're creating waves. Mm -hmm.